double ups, keeping this wine in line. Yeah, I went in earlier and I told him that I'm pressed, that I want to go in and, you know, as pressed, going in the, the, let you guys see what's up with the U.S. Senator Martin Heinrich. Uh, and they're telling me that's uh, invitationals only. Then I guess you're not invited. Good morning, guys. Wrangler here. And today we're going to be looking at Four Corner Fist in the Air, who I'm going to start calling the El Dope Dog of New Mexico. Now, he's come to a hospital, which is definitely a limited public forum, because it's an invitation-only press event where a senator is visiting the hospital. And he's all butthurt because, well, he's not press. Y'all will have to forgive me that I'm shooting this on my phone, but with the snow and storm that's moved in, it's screwing with the Internet. So hopefully everything's back to acting right by tonight. So we're going to watch him get bounced from the hospital. It's fun. I just want you guys to come in here because I'm going to go back in there. I asked for a supervisor and they're telling me it's a private hospital is what they're telling me. And they're telling me it's a private hospital, but I just looked up online and it said it's community owned. Matthew the King. So, so I'm going to go back in there and see if I can talk to uh, the supervisor. But they're, what they're telling me is that the supervisor is telling them that uh, invitational is only press. And I tell them that's not very constitutional of them. And they should allow me to go in there as press under the Constitution of the United States, the First Amendment. Not going to happen. No, not going to happen. <laughs> not. So I just wanted to let you guys know. Do you know they told me? It's invitationals only, and I uh, just want to let you, they told me, that, more or less that I'm not invited. So, Rick Ferrari, welcome in. Well, if you are not invited, and you are not there receiving medical services, you are not visiting someone who is there receiving medical services, or you don't work there, or in your case, you're not part of the legitimate press and have been invited, then you know what you're doing. You're trespassing. So I'm going to go back in there and see if they'll see what they say. They told me I can, you know, it's only an uh, invitation only, but I'm trying to let them know I'm, I'm pressed too. Yeah, I just want to see if I can speak to the supervisor. And then, you know, let them tell me if it's, uh, if it's a private hospital because that's what they're telling me. Hello, what's your name? How can I help you? Uh, is this open to the public? No. It is not open to recordings. Uh, it's public, right? Yes, but not inside the hospital. Well, There's heard privacy that, I heard for everybody the, here. I heard the U.S. Senator's mm -hmm. here. U.S. Senator, I heard the U.S. Senator's here. I am not a senator. I'm just security for the hospital. There's no senator here. He's already left. He's already left. Yeah. Wow, would you look at that? That looks like one of those uh, mythical press badges that the frauditors claim don't exist. He's, he's already left for me. Okay, yeah, that's okay. all I, I came here. Just, uh, I'm a member of the press, you know. I can't, I can't hear you with the mask. You can speak over here. I came in earlier and I wanted to exercise my right under the First Amendment at press, you know. Mm -hmm. You know, the, um, you know the Constitution of the United States, right? The First mm -hmm. Amendment? The, uh, we trust the five freedoms that we have? Mm -hmm. Yes. What's the five freedoms that we have? Yes, but I can't hardly hear you with that mask on. What's the five freedoms that we have? The five what? freedoms? The five freedoms. I'm not answering anything while you're videotaping. Can I get your name in the background? No. Boom. Roasted. And again, dude, it's a hospital. Stop being such a creep. And I don't believe there's a New Mexico law that states she has to give you any information whatsoever. Just go away, little L dope dog. You work for the public? Hmm? You no, work for the I, public? I work for the hospital. Really? Okay. And that's all I'm answering for you. It's not very professional. I'm just trying to ask you I simple said, questions. I'm not answering anything while you're recording me. You don't want to answer a few questions? No. 
Because you don't know the United States Constitution, I said, right? I am not answering Be professional, man. Okay. I'm just trying to ask you. Another unemployed frauditor who wants to lecture those that are employed about having a job and professionalism. And again, don't be going around lecturing and quizzing folks on the Constitution when you haven't the foggiest idea what it means. You can leave. What am I doing wrong? 21 to available officers. Turn your camera off. I'm leaving. Yes, I have a gentleman over here recording in the hospital and invading other people's privacy. No, I should say no, I'm trying to get other people. If it's if I can it see it from public, I can film it yeah, from public. No. I need some backup. No, she's saying I, she needs some backup. Will you arrest me if I trust if I don't leave? No, I'll have you, I'll have officers escort you off the property. Police officers, not security. Okay, you give me enough we're a professional public service. I just wanted to come in and ask, talk to your supervisor. <laughs> you don't have to harass me. No. I'm exercising my my rights under the first. Can I get your name, sir? I noticed that you took a picture of me. Sean? <clears throat> You guys don't have to follow me. That's what you call harassing. Actually, it's what you call trespassing, as you've been told to leave several times. So why don't you actually obey the law? So I'm going to be on my way and don't be harassing me. I just came here to see if I can redress my grievance with the U.S. Senator. Not going to happen. Typical of a frauding piece of garbage to think that the senator, just because you try to ambush them in public, has to make time for you on the spot. If you want to speak with the senator, I highly recommend you be professional and call and get in. Can I speak to the manager, please? You guys have a good day. Can I speak to the manager, please? The manager's on his way. Yeah, this guy's taking pictures of me. Well, he's just exercising his First Amendment right. Correct? Stop harassing me. Are you the manager? No. Now they're harassing me. Wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. It seems to me that they're just walking around a parking lot. I mean, I don't see how that's harassment. Nobody's even talking to you. Let me pass the fist. I'll come in. Got some tyrants here. Yeah, I gotta keep an eye on them. For the record, yeah. Here you guys. I just wanted to, as press, go in here to see what, see if I can address my grievances with the. Uh, it was Senator Martin Heinrich. That fat one over there, security guard, told me it was private property. Oh yeah, right. Right, Michael Ghost. Right, that's all I was trying to do is ask you, you know, I want to talk to your manager, I want to supervise or something. But here's the thing, if you want to redress your government, you do it through petition. And nowhere in the constitution does it say that you have a right to a manager when you're trespassing at a hospital this is transparency oh, i heard the u.s uh martin heinrich is here i wanted to go in and see if i can 
you know, see what was going on. And you guys told me it's private property. You know, they're harassing me, stalking me. How you doing? How are you? Doing good. Name your badge number? Yeah, I'm Officer Cummings, 917. 917? Yeah. What's going on today, man? Oh, I just heard uh, the U.S. Senator. I heard the U.S. Senator was here, you know. And the who? U.S. Senator. Was here? Yeah, the Martin, Martin Heinrich. Oh, that's right, yeah. Yeah, then I wanted to go in here and exercise my First Amendment and, yeah. you know, it's press and yeah. you know, business card right there. You know, nothing, I didn't do a criminal crime or do nothing. I just wanted to talk to a, a manager or supervisor about me going in there because they told me I could it. Yeah, can and, I have yeah you can have it. Okay. Yeah, but, you know, that's all I was doing. I they, they, started, you, they started coming after me and yeah. they started, you know, they, not everybody uh... intimidating me. And... You're a bitch. They told you to leave the property many times. You didn't. And all they literally did was walk in the parking lot, get in their cars and leave. And that was just the actual legitimate press who were there. And then what happened? They took a picture of you and you feel intimidated. Well, you know what? Too fucking bad. That's what you assholes do to your innocent victims in every one of your videos. How does it feel? Yeah. yeah well, okay, let me ask you this. How are they intimidating you? Well, they started following me out. I okay. told them I was leaving. Okay. Yeah, then I was, you know, that's, they kept coming up to me and that's all, that's all I was doing, you know. Yeah. Just exercising my First Amendment, just filming in public. Sure. Yeah. Um, when they, uh, were you going to leave? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's all, that's all I'm doing now. I'm, I'm not worried you know? about it, man. Yeah. I, I yeah, got I you. appreciate it. appreciate <laughs> the understanding, you know. Yeah, no, we know what you do, man. And, yeah. Uh, I, I think what they were worried about was the, like, the they have a policy. Um, yeah, on the no recording, did they explain that to you at all or no? no policy to over Trump law, you know. Like, that's, sure, that's, no, that's 100%. Their, yeah, that's, that's their policy, you yeah. know. If they want to, you know, that's public lobby, you know, I know that, you know, yeah. what I can see. Wrong, 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 wrong. No, what that is, is a limited public forum. It's a hospital, all right? And if you're not there to receive the services or to visit someone receiving services, or you're not employed there, then guess what? You're not welcome there. You don't have a right to video and disseminate onto YouTube the goings on inside a hospital where people are sick and unaliving. You lazy, stupid son of a bitch. People uh, that are in charge of the hospital? Yeah. Um, they have a policy there that it's a private business that they, you can't film inside the hospital. Yeah, policy don't over Trump law though. Ooh, yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to go ahead and sort of disagree with you there. Well, okay, you wanna talk about how law? How about loitering on private property? How about trespassing on private property? As you just said, that is a private business. Yes, they provide medical care and emergency services, but at the end of the day, it's a private business. You don't have a right to be there. So th they're a private business? Um, That's, I just read it on the, on, on the internet, it's a community. So, uh, sir, it's it's a private entity, okay? Well, no, so, he was just doing just good a while ago. And now you have to, you know, push entity, it a little. So I'm just telling you, they, you're not allowed to film in there for their policies. They can. I was in a public lobby. They're a private business. So if they ask you to be trespassed, you can be trespassed, okay? You, it's <laughs> So thank you for being compliant and leaving um, when they asked you to, and you're you're welcome to film in public or we'll yeah. go to a private business. That was a, I heard the U.S. Senator was here. The U.S. Senator was here. That's how I came under the First Amendment to redress my grievances okay. under the press. But again, they're a private business. You can go 10-8, Jones. Um, they're a private business. So. Mm -hmm. They're, they can make their own rules. Can you can you re, can you uh, redress the? Uh, I mean, can you uh, tell me the five freedoms that we have? So, sir. The word diligent. That's spelled D I L L I G A M. Diligent, and it means, do I look like I give a fuck?
I'm not going to engage in this with you. I'm just telling you what the hospital. Can you just let me know if you know the five freedoms? You don't. So I'm I'm not going to even discuss that. This is the reason why you're coming at me uh, no, sideways. No, it's not. It's to advise you that the hospital. Their has policies their does not trump policies. the Constitution of the so United States. I'm my First you, sir, Amendment. If they've asked you to leave and you do not do so, you can be trespassed from that property. Okay. That's all I'm telling you. Do you understand that? You got a First Amendment fail. This guy's a pass. Okay. You, you're more than welcome to film on private, on public property, but not on private. Property. No more cops explaining. Okay. You're dismissed. And this is why I call these frauditing trash prank channels. When you give them, you answer their question and give them the law. It's cop explaining. If you tell them what they're legally not allowed to do, you're being a tyrant. That's why I call you prank channels because you go out fishing for a predetermined result. You want a certain result so that you can have clickbait, which makes you more of a whore than a lot lizard. Four corner fist in the air, you were definitely officially renamed the El Dope Dog of New Mexico because you have no idea what you're allowed to do and what you're not allowed to do. You can't just roll everything up into, oh, well, I have the first. The first allows me to do this because you don't. You're not in a traditional public forum. You're on private property. Even if you weren't, even if that was a community owned hospital, it would be a limited public forum. That place is there for people to get medical care. It is not there for you to avoid having to grow up and get an actual job so you can get off food stamps. Anyway, guys, which we're, we're going to wrap this one up. It's Wrangler. I'm out of here. I love y'all. Have a good one, and I hope the internet's up and back working by tonight. Peace out.